I've had a very positive response. So from that, I've uh, <clears throat> sort of been, been, been talking to fans and so forth about what to do in the future. What's funny, I suppose you didn't, when you put your stuff on YouTube, Yeah. because Harry Potter fans are such... They're, they're incredible. They find out anything, don't they? I yeah. Because they found out. Literally, within within an hour, I was uh, you call me naive, I suppose, for not not realising that was going to happen. But I really thought, put it under a separate name. Uh, it's a very it's a black and white film. It's not a very detailed film. I thought I'd be fine, but uh, literally within a few hours, it started to get sort of a few hundred hits, and I thought, wait a minute, this isn't this isn't right. I only sent it out for one person to to see, so. I was I was flattered to be honest with you about how many, the response it got and the people and 99% out of the comments are all very positive and seem genuine. So uh, no, I'm thrilled to, for people to hear my music. Um, in tr kind of on the same lines, I, I interviewed one of the cast last year. I've forgotten exactly who it was, Go on. but he said that he created a Facebook profile and he gave himself a false name. Within two days, he was getting emails from people from Harry Potter fans going, "Are you?" Something? Yeah, yeah. So do you do you have an alias? I've had. Well, Felt Beats was supposed to be it, uh, the one that I used the YouTube video, but unfortunately, that's sort of been foiled now. Uh, I have given up on all on all forms of uh, internet socialising because it does seem there's a lot of there's a lot of Tom Felton's out there who are uh, who are taking the role for me so um, uh, I haven't been left many names to, to divulge with. Um, we're kind of looking at Christmas stuff at the moment. Okay. We're coming around the corner. Yeah sure um, don't remind me. Potter's always on the TV. Yeah. Do you have to be reminded of looking 12 years old? It's, it is a mo mo one of the most funny things ever is seeing uh, is seeing not just myself but seeing all the other cast members because we all know each other now and I like to say, everyone's an adult now, everyone can drive, everyone can drink. And seeing us at the age of sort of 12, 13, with the very high voices, especially Dan's, is most hilarious. He gets a phone call every year, taking the mickey out of it. It is hilarious. Have you got, do you have to get your friends and family Potter-related gifts for Christmas? <laughs> do they let you off? Thankfully not, no. They're not, they're not, uh, they're not as, as, uh, as mad fans as they, uh, as they could be, so thankfully no. Christmas isn't, isn't a wizarding uh, opportunity for them. What's your what's your best kind of Christmas? Do you get time off? You obviously get yeah, time yeah, off. no, they're quite they're quite generous there in that in that respect. Uh, family for Christmas and New Year, so yeah, I mean my idea of a Christmas is obviously kind of fire on, cold outside, and the family all inside the house. Um, did you manage to see Daniel Radcliffe on Broadway or, or in Equus? I mean, I've only yeah. seen I've seen snippets of it. I can't believe um, I never went to go and see him in, in England, but we're supposed to be going over there actually towards the. Uh, towards the new year so uh i'm really looking forward to it i've heard nothing but great things and he said he's having a, a great time doing it so you're all going on mass to go and watch it well fingers crossed and not all of us i say just just my girlfriend and i she's a she's a keen fan to watch it as well so no we'd love to see it obviously we've heard it we've heard nothing but great things and finally what 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 is going to be there for you after potter when oh don't ask me that you like have you started thinking you don't know? that's the that's the worst I mean, thing yeah retirement fund but you want you're, 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 i wish <laughs> <laughs> but no i mean it really is a case of, uh, of looking to the future really and trying to build from what we've uh, from already established um so i'm i'm really excited to walk you know all sorts of uh of different ac acting roles different acting parts and uh you know maybe documentaries or you know i'm i'm open doors i'm i'm very excited for the future i'm not I'm not fearful of it. I'm uh, I'm very keen to see what see what it will provide. Do you want to get behind the camera at any point? I, I mean, I, I, again, it's nothing that I would I would say no to. I mean, I don't consider myself much of a director or a writer, but there's both things that I would love to uh, to to put interest to in the future, definitely. Brilliant.